Welcome to another episode of the Art Patient. Thank you for joining me. Um, Nettle season has begun, so obviously I have been picking rather a large bag of nettles, and rightly so. In this episode, we're going to talk about what nettles can do for you. Regards boosting testosterone. Uh, it won't boost it guys if you're looking to boost it like the guys in the gym it don't boost it that much <laughs> nature doesn't quite work like uh, that <laughs> um, boosting testosterone and eradicating urinary tract infections and eradicating an enlarged prostate may I say of all the years I've been dealing with nettles I'm laying them out on the tray here. Um, they've got some called trichomes, which contain formic acid. It's the formic acid that gives you the sting. And um, I've never overcome the sting in all the years I've been dealing with nettles. And when I collect the nettles and cut them, I've got gloves on. And as you can see, I'm using tongs here. Um, I don't recommend any of the party tricks where you actually roll one up and put it under your tongue because um, the trichomes really do sting like a bee. So why are they so protected with all the trichomes on the upper and lower surfaces? And why do they sting so bad? Because if you've got the ultimate multivitamin protein drink from nature all those herbivores out there are going to go mad to get hold of it and then there'd be none of it left for people like you and me to come along with a pair of scissors would that so think of it that way when any when anything in nature is absolutely fantastic it is always well protected as we'll talk about with all thorn trees and rose petals. Um, now guys, you're dealing with a live product here up until the time you actually put it in the oven and dehydrate it somewhat. Um, the time in the oven is about five minutes, six minutes, very, very low. We just want to crisp them and dry them out and then the hot water will extract all those nutrients. Now, stinging nettle or Urtica dioica, given its right name, is probably the ultimate multivitamin from nature. Um, I could be here for an hour and a half talking about stinging nettle, but I've got the best part of seven to ten minutes. Um, and so we'll make the most of that we'll start with the nutrients now the nutrients are literally off the scale we can start with vitamin c for a start it contains nettles contain more vitamin c per hundred milligram than an orange yes you heard me say it an orange so there's more vitamin c in nettles than there is in oranges per weight um, there's vitamin the B vitamins are in there there's folic acid there's folate and there's vitamin A in beta carotenes they have a full range of minerals magnesium which relaxes prostates and urinary tracts and arteries calcium potassium more art energy again iron for the blood and they're very very high in protein as well they're full of carotenoids antioxidants lutein beta carotene the beta carotene gets converted by the liver to vitamin a they are a kidney cleanser a lymph cleanser and have the ability 
to reduce a enlarged prostate all you guys out there who have suffered with and my myself suffered with an enlarged prostate it's horrible you keep having to run off to the toilet every 15 or 20 minutes because you can't micturate micturation is uh, going to the toilet and urinating um, because the prostate squeezes on the urethra that runs to the bladder you can't lose enough urine nettles are quite simply the answer to that they answer that problem quite easily and nettles do better than that they actually um, increase and free up testosterone in the plasma uh, they do this by working on sex hormone binding globulin and they're able to increase testosterone levels but like I said at the start of this video don't expect testosterone levels like the guys who are shooting drugs at the local gym because that's not going to happen in nature when anybody talks about pine pollen or nettles as a testosterone booster in nature don't get the impression um, it's very very balanced in nature so you have an herbal diuretic which will all those people who suffer from water retention you're going to lose that water retention by drinking nettles um, and you're going to retain unlike pharmaceutical drugs um, that apply diuresis you're going to retain your minerals instead of your minerals going down the toilet like a lot of farmers well majority of pharmaceutical drugs if you're on pharmaceutical drugs your minerals are going down the toilet guys full stop if you suffer with um, allergic rhinitis uh, this time of year such as asthma eczema hay fever any of these um, nettles is the way to go because nettles contain histamine now the histamine from nettles will sit on the histamine receptor site within your body and reprogram it and it will react very very differently um, this has been proven in many laboratory studies guys but you're up against the pharmaceutical cartels who would sooner have you on salbutamol inhalers for the rest of your life and antihistamines for the rest of your life and steroids for the rest of your life it's a repeat business guy. so i'm going to leave you with a dilemma to think about why is it that all the wild animals that feed in nature never get sick and why is it that us humans walk around queuing up for prescription drugs all the time and we're the sickest people on the planet and then your doctor tells you you're allergic to nature strange that isn't it until next time guys thank you for watching thanks very much